the bridge here at Flightless, heading east back up to meet the helicopter to finish off our amazing trip here in Tomatea Dusky Sound. This trip has been such an eye opener to the amazing conservation work and the hard yards that people who really care are putting in and it's just been amazing to be around such passionate people and I hope I can take this passion back to my home. We're coming to the end of our journey here in Tamatea Dusky Sound. It's been an amazing experience and I think I'd like to come back. Some of the highlights for me were definitely snorkeling, seeing all of the things there are to see, like all the bush, it's all so beautiful, all the sea animals, they're just so amazing. I learnt about a new sea creature, which is the black coral, and it was quite interesting because it's only black when it's dead, so it's quite a nice white, pearly colour. A couple of the highlights for me have been seeing some amazing birds I've never seen before, the kaka, and seeing some super cute little fjord crested penguin. The marine life is just so vibrant here. Seen uh, so many crayfish. I caught the biggest blue cod, that was a bonus. And just being in such an untouched and uh, remote destination. After this trip, I went to pick up snorkeling again. I used to do a lot of it, but I've kind of been a bit slack on it so I think I'd like to do more of it because the ocean is such a beautiful place and I'd like to appreciate it a bit more. For conservation I think I'd like to do more trapping so maybe setting up a few traps around my house to catch all the rats just to protect I guess the birds in my backyard like the tuis, pigeons, kiwi, all those birds. I'd like to have a look at my local trapping line I know quite a few of the people on it, but they're all quite old, so I'd like to bring my mates along, start getting myself and the younger people interested in this and gripped by the conservation like I have been. My advice is if you go on an adventure like this, you should definitely say yes to everything because you can see so much stuff. It's just an amazing experience. As you can see here, the weather's quite challenging, but I've learnt that there's no such thing as bad weather down here. You'd be crazy to miss an opportunity to explore this wilderness here. We have snow just behind us, but we still rugged up and walked up some amazing hills and caught some beautiful views. So back at home, even if it's raining, get out there, see what there is to see, because you never know what'll happen if you just say yes.